Why is YouTube so fucking weird? Okay, it's okay. We're fine. It's fine. I look like a vampire. I look so pale. Okay, it's fine. What should we do first? <gasps> Let's do this. Bye-bye breakout. Period, queen. Concentrated derma serum. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce these words. Salicylic acid, lactic acid, and postbiotic ferment. Okay. I'm in my YouTuber era. <gasps> YouTube queen, YouTube star. Perfect. It's like Christmas. Okay, let's do this one. Anyways, I'm not really a PR girly. Like, I really don't get PR ever. I'm not like on a lot of people's PR lists, which, like, sad. I would like to be. But it's, it cosmetics, me and them have been going strong for a while. Ooh. <gasps> it's a mascara closet. What? And you just like open up the little closet. Wait, I want to do the full experience. <gasps> Are you guys seeing this? Look at it. Layla. Oh my gosh, how cute. I'm so excited for these. Not three different mascaras. Oh my God, I love it. Look at that. I've used this one before. Hello Lashes. Focus. Okay, I'm not in my YouTuber era, but you get the point. And then this one. Superhero. Literally, she's just plain black. I want this to like work so bad. I want to like be an actual YouTuber. It's not working, just focused on me. Which like period queen, it should be focused on me, but read the room. Celebrate Mother's Day with it? When was Mother's Day? Sorry, mom. I'm the worst daughter ever. Look how cute, it's like in a little bag. Oh my gosh. Holy shit. More mascara. Okay, I'm not running out of mascara now for a hot minute. That's good. Confidence and a cleanser. Ooh, I needed a new cleanser. Yay, look at it. Yes, 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 yes. I needed a good cleanser. Ooh, confidence and a cream. Transforming, moisturizing, super cream for all skin types. Yay. I've been trying to be a hydrated queen. I've been loving putting on like thick moisturizer at night. Everyone's like, oh my gosh, what do you put on your skin like before you start your makeup? Like your skin looks so glowy. I'm like, well, one, your girl is oily as fuck. So that's just my natural grease, you know, just pretty gross. But I've been hydrating my face a lot. Okay, let's do the big daddy. Wait, this is gonna be the thumbnail. Is this how people do it? We got a long way to go, you guys. No fucking way. You can't probably see this, but they literally sent me a blender. This is a little blender. Shut up. Wait, what movie is that from? Shut up. Mean Girls? I don't know. Love. Oh my gosh, I have been wanting, I've always wanted an eye cream and I've just like never bought in one or bought one. Oh. But now I have an eye cream. There we go. Your girl is gonna look fucking snatched. They literally gave me a blender. I'm gonna use this so much. This is the coolest thing ever. Happy Monday, besties. I'm having a shitty day. Literally like woke up, okay? Opened up my blind, said hello world. I'm ready to have a good start to my week. Bike stolen. Bike is gone. Literally, she's gone. I can see the bike rack like from my apartment. So I just like did a little wellness check on her um, as I do because I'm a good bike mother. And yeah, she's gone. Just the tire, just one tire, a singular tire is left. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So I don't know what the fuck is wrong with people, but what did I do to deserve this? Why do bad things happen to good people? On a more positive note, um, my mother ordered me a Keurig because I was saying how I only ever drink iced coffee but I don't have an actual coffee maker because a few years ago I gave her my Keurig because selfless queen that I am. Um, so let's unbox her. This is like a really big unboxing video because also today I'm supposed to get my new iMac. Also vlogging, this shit is hard, okay? YouTube is hard. I keep like looking to see if you guys are watching. <laughs> 
Oh, she's beautiful. Look at her. Stunning. Oh, I'm gonna drop it. I'm gonna drop it. Pop off, queen. Cooking space, that's cute. Got my little coffee wine area, and then those just, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Some guy off a of dating app just messaged me. I was like, who the fuck? Um, anyways, I've been waiting around all day for my computer to get here in the mail because it's supposed to be out for delivery, but I like, I'm tired of just waiting around all day. I'm in such a bad mood because of my fucking stolen bike, and I have zero groceries, so. I think we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. This is the outfit. Um, you can't really tell. It's just a like set active one piece jumpsuit, classic. And this little cropped jacket is from Hollister or like Gilly Hicks. And my hair is kind of greasy because it's been a week since I washed it. So we're putting on a white headband to tie it all together. It smells like boy cologne. I have a crush on the maintenance guy that works here and I matched with him on a dating app and we were texting for a while but like nothing ever came from it but I get really scared that I'm gonna like run into him when I'm like looking like this, you know what I mean? So. Taking out the trash, taking out the trash, taking out the trash, 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 trash. This lighting is bad. Why the fuck is Trader Joe's always so hard to find parking? I also came at like the worst time. It's like almost five o'clock. People are getting off work, getting their like Monday groceries. Anyways, I basically have it down to a science of like what I get from Trader Joe's. I have my favorites. I have my essentials. I have just like my easy like go-to types of foods. So I'm not, you know, we're just gonna stick with the basics today. I'm not trying to try out any new recipes or do anything crazy. Mm-mm. No, because I'm not even kidding. Trader Joe's is like the place that I go to for when I need to be happy and therapy. And I just always know what to expect. I know what I get. I love Trader Joe's. I love the people. What the fuck is going on today? Something is really weird in the air because that was the worst Trader Joe's experience I think I've ever had. I saw people I didn't want to see. They didn't have any food, any of the regular things that I normally eat and like all I know I like they didn't have and so like I think I jinxed myself by saying like I'm just gonna go in get what I need to get get what I always get and then you know make it easy no but on the plus side I got some things that I haven't had before so let me show you what I got from Trader Joe's <laughs> since mother dearest got me a Keurig which I'm so excited about I got some um, fall like autumn maple coffee cups to make some coffee and I've also heard that the maple flavor is really good so that's exciting I've also been wanting to try out these two like oat beverages this is a creamer it's the brown sugar oat creamer and then this is a like non-dairy pumpkin spice oat beverage so basically oat milk and an oat creamer I don't know we'll try it out they're cold brew I use their cold brew my obsession is buffalo chicken dip okay buffalo chicken dip is what gets me through life on the daily Guess what they didn't have at Trader Joe's today? Buffalo chicken dip. So I settled and I'm gonna try this vegan buffalo dip. Um, I don't know, it's probably better for me because I shouldn't probably be eating as much like dairy and shit like that. So this is a plant-based dairy-free buffalo dip. We shall see. I also grabbed New England clam chowder. I don't even really think I like clam chowder, but I decided to grab it. I've been wanting to take a solo trip up into like the Northeast. And so I think like I've been watching a lot of like TikToks about like Maine and New Hampshire and like all of those places. So I think I'm like, that was like in my head. I was like, ooh, like a lobster roll and like clam chowder. I don't know. I haven't had these in a while and I absolutely love these. They're not that healthy for you, but they're just like a sweet treat in the mornings. I've really not had an appetite in the mornings lately. I've been just drinking my coffee and then having lunch, but these are like a good kind of like real little replacement. This is the mango smoothie juice and this is a banana almond butter like protein smoothie. This one is definitely like better, but grabbed those. I got some potatoes. Layla, you're being rude. Anyways. 
I grabbed some salmon. I have not made salmon. Oh, I bet you want salmon. That's what you're smelling. I have not made salmon in so long. I used to really like it. So, and it's healthy. It's like a really good protein. Yeah, so I'm gonna actually try to make this and not let it just go bad in my fridge like I usually do. I grabbed some like prosciutto, pepperoni, whatever, and some crackers. <gasps> Sorry and this goat cheese so i want to do like a wine and crackers like a charcuterie board basically like a wine and cheese night for the bachelorette you know bachelor in paradise vibes that's the thought process on that one i saw these and i want to try them they're organic chicken nuggets you know it's it's something new organic breaded nugget shaped chicken breast patties with rib meat sure i don't know it's easy. It's chicken nuggets, you know. They also didn't have the soup dumplings that I'm obsessed with. Everything was out, you guys. Literally every single thing that I normally eat was gone. So I found these, and they are not the same. And it worries me that there were so many of them left. But it's these types of dumplings. So I'll try these out. Hopefully they're good. I don't really know what the difference is between the two, but... I grabbed one of my like favorite pre-made salads. I love their Greek salad. I don't know why, but some pineapple because it's on brand for me. Apparently, pineapple, pineapple, pineapple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I grabbed some pineapple, and that's it. That's the haul. I'm really pissed off. <laughs> I just checked my mail, and I have another thing of PR. Come on, Layla, join join the party. Okay, this is something that I get probably the most questions about anytime I'm on TikTok or on live and everyone's like, where's the headband from? I got another one, <laughs> yay. The answer is from Burst. It's like my favorite thing to like use to get my hair back when I'm doing my makeup and stuff or skincare. They're out of sight dark spot gel because I do have like a lot of actual like dark spots from like acne scarring and things. This is their Daily Mineral Sunscreen, which I already have and I really like. It's really good to apply like before your makeup. It just, one, you should protect your skin, but two, it just creates like a really pretty glowy base under your foundation. This is their Daymaker Micro Crystal Exfoliator, which I'm super excited about. I've been wanting to try it. I've never had it, um, but I really do need to exfoliate my skin like really bad. And their Daily Brightening Moisturizer with like vitamin C and cloudberry oil. What the fuck is a cloudberry? I give up. <laughs> I literally waited around all day because I needed to like sign for this. They just dropped it off in the mail room. Like literally did not even require a signature or anything. We love that. But anyways, I got it. It's so big. <gasps> Look at it. Good morning, you guys. It is officially the next day, and I am currently editing the video that you just watched. Isn't that crazy? If you made it to the end of this video, which apparently you did if you're watching this, I love you so much. Thank you so much for joining the first ever video. I know it was probably a little rough. We have a lot of learning to do together. This shit is hard, okay? But stick around, trust the process, enjoy the journey, hit the subscribe button, smash the like button, leave a little comment what you wanna see, what you're excited for. <laughs> It's yeah, okay, okay. I love you so much. I do, I love you. And I will hopefully see you guys soon in the next video. I don't know what it's gonna be. Layla, you wanna say bye? Bye! Say bye! Mwah. Love you, bye!